in December 2016, I came down with something called Ramsey Hunt Syndrome. And basically what it is, is it was shingles inside my ear. I was bedridden for a month and a half. I missed almost two months of work because uh, I'm a school teacher. And through the whole time, I just kept thinking, you know, I'm not gonna blame this on God because I wasn't raised that way. I said, maybe God has a bigger plan for me. And it was so bad that, you know, there's times I just wanted to give up. I'm like, this, this is just a horrible condition. A very rare condition that I have that the doctors don't have answers for. And so I've kind of turned in the direction of, you know what, I'm gonna beat this, I'm gonna get over it, and it's gonna be God that's gonna heal me. And I believe that. Pastor Blunt was teaching on spiritual gifts. He went through different passages uh, in the Bible about knowing your spiritual gifts, being led by the Holy Spirit. You, know, you gotta find it and you gotta use that. It kind of like gave me a purpose to what maybe I should be doing. As time went along, that kind of led me into being more interested in the healing of uh, the sick and praying for the sick. Now I'm leaning more towards when I retire from my teaching profession, um, uh, being involved in, in a ministry somehow. Baseball's been a big part of my life, my family's life for a long time, but nothing's bigger than the grace of God and His ministry. <laughs> and I think I've kind of seen that, that that's what I want to do. Not just, I don't just want to teach the gospel, I want to live the gospel. It gave me a new direction to get more involved again, and, and it just took me in a new spiritual direction. Bottom line is, you want to try to lead people to Christ. Baseball is great, but there's a bigger picture than baseball, and that bigger picture is Jesus.